guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you yet another wig that I was sent to review by Ebony Line. And it's their Vivian wig. And I have it in the color 1B. So the full name for this wig is MLF501 Vivian. And this is a stock card that it comes with. So I'm just gonna put this on and we can get right into the video. So it does come with one huge comb at the back, two adjustable straps. So I'm gonna put some foundation on the inside of the lace. So straight out the pot, this is how it looks, which is a little bit crazy. Um, I don't feel like it looks anything like that stock card. I'm just gonna brush it down a bit. I'll throw this a little and see if I can like it some more. So I'm just gonna use my my hot comb. Um, this does not actually say that this wig is heat friendly. So if you wreck your wig, please don't blame me. I'm not telling you to do this. I'm just gonna try this because it does have a little hump right here. So I feel like this is the best I could get from this wig. I don't know. Um, so this part here just sticks out. Like the curls are like this. Why do we keep doing that? Like it's going this way. Like no, I'm trying to straighten it down. This shit keep going like whoop. Like no, go do. This shit pissing me off. <laughs> it's doing it like my mama. I don't know why. Just right here. And I know it's possible for the curls to be deformed because um like just the packaging and stuff to put them in a little plastic container but i can't get them out and i use this little iron on it and i couldn't it does look a little bit sleeker since i put a little heat on it but like i said i couldn't see anything on the stock card that says that it's great for heat or it's heat safe so definitely be careful with that i put my iron on 350 so as it relates to shedding it does have a little bit of shedding so I'll probably give the hair a little shake before putting it on just to be on the safe side. I do like the color of it on me and the, the length is nice. I actually like over this side. I kind of got them fold under. I feel like uh, maybe putting the hair on a mannequin head for a few nights would help because it's just all bent out of shape because of the packaging maybe. Okay, so I feel like it looks a little better this way. Um, the texture of it is really nice. I love how it feels. It has a very nice silky texture. Overall, I think it is an okay everyday wig. Probably wouldn't be the one I reach for all the time because like I said, the hairs at the back are all kinked out of shape. If we're gonna be comparing it to the stock card though, I don't feel like it looks anything like this. I was really expecting it to be like more of a layered look. A little wider at the bottom like it definitely doesn't have that body and volume like on the stock card on its own it looks good it just doesn't look like the stock card i'd probably give this hair three out of five stars but yeah if you are interested in trying this wig if you like it or you want to get it in another color definitely check out ebony line i will put a link in the description box so you can go check out ebony line they sell tons of wigs and hair accessories and stuff including this hot comb that I was using like 20 bucks by the way. Have you worn this Vivian wig before? Is yours like mine or is it like the stock card? Let me know in the comment section below and if you are new around here please hit that subscribe button give this video a thumbs up because it's absolutely free to do so and you can also hit the notification bell so you'll never miss an upload. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.